What's good, YouTube, man? Beast Fit. And I'm back, man. I know I haven't recorded a video in a while, but I've had a lot of personal things going on. You know, I just recently had a death in the family. So I've been kind of dealing with a lot, you know. Um, I've still been going to the gym, you know, but I haven't been recording anything. My focus has really just been, you know, just pumping iron. That's been my way to kind of get, you know, my emotions out instead of crying or anything like that, you know taking it out on the weights you know that's been my thing but today i'm headed to the gym right now and i'm gonna do a compound movement workout so basically what i mean when i say that is my four the four major compound movements uh bench press squats overhead press and deadlifts is what i'm gonna be doing today um i've done this once before and i felt pretty good doing it so I'm gonna do it again today. Um, and I'm just gonna get some raw workout footage for you guys to kind of show you how I go about doing this. Now, I'm not necessarily working up to any one rep maxes or anything like that. Now, I am gonna test my strength though, but I'm not I'm not focused on working up to any one rep max. So depending on how I'm feeling with bench press, I may, you know, decide to test my strength. You know, depending on how I'm feeling with squats, I may decide to test my strength. I may decide to do it, but I'm not going in with the mindset to work up to a one rep max for each exercise or each movement. So, appreciate you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this workout video. Team Beast, let's get it. All right, what's good, man? We at the gym now. The first compound movement we're gonna start with is bench press. So I'm gonna go bench press, deadlifts, low bar squats, and then overhead press. So that's gonna be the order I do this. And then after I'm gonna do some bicep work just because I wanna work biceps. But the first one we started with is bench press. So I'm gonna give y'all some raw footage, walk y'all through, and how I approach doing the bench press. show y'all the clip of me failing and I'm going to show you guys where I am now to prove to you that all you got to do is stay consistent and the work will pay off. Hard work will always pay off. Just stay consistent, stay motivated and keep pushing. Let's get it. And to add to that, I failed and had a spotter helping me take the weight off. This time I'm doing it with no spotter, no nothing. Team beast. I'm 
this trash. That was kind of hard. <laughs> Alright, so from now on, I'm hitting 295. But from now on, a, a part of me wants to wants to go for 315 today. I'm never going for 315. I'm never going for anything over 295. To be honest, um, depending on how this feels, I may go for 305. Depending on how that feels, I'm gonna go for 315. So stay tuned, and you'll see. You'll see what I decide to do. First time I tried to get to 295, my right side gave up on me. So, but the second time, I was able to get it. So all I did in between those sets was I did some stretches for my right shoulder. It was my right shoulder that kind of gave out. And it didn't, nothing popped or nothing felt hurt. Um, nothing felt like it was hurting or anything. I just didn't have any, like I didn't feel any stretch. It was almost like my arm was fake. Like I didn't feel nothing. So I just did some stretching, um, working on my rotator cuff, stuff like that. I then went for it again, and I was able to get it the second time. So, um, usually I wouldn't feel comfortable going up to 305 um, because I did struggle with the 295 a little bit, but I am going to go for 305 today. Um, I said in my intro that I was going to push on bench press, and that's what I'm about to do. So I'm going to push. I'm going to try to go for 305. I have a spotter today, so whether I'm able to get it or not, I have a spotter, so it'll be fine. So, So, finish bench pressing. Now I'm on to deadlifts. Um, and pretty much, I'm just gonna work up to uh, probably four or five today. I'm not sure. I'm not sure exactly how I'm feeling so far. One plate felt pretty good, so I make it up to four or five. Um, I did not get the 305. I got about halfway, and then could not get it no further. So, hopefully by the end of this month, I'm able to get that up. So, we'll see. Stay tuned. Team Beast. Beast 
get tired too. You know that? And I'm tired. And I'm kidding. What I'm gonna do is though, and I'm gonna wait until I can get four or five for three or four reps, comfortable three or four reps. You know, not a struggling two reps, right? That was kind of stupid. But a comfortable three or four reps with four or five, then I'm gonna bump the weight up. So right now, I'm just dropping down to 315. I'm gonna kind of rep out with 315 for maybe about one or two sets, and then I'm gonna move on to low bar squats. I just want to say that clearly, this gym has ghosts that's holding down the weight when you try to lift it. I think that's what happened for real. Training for 455 and 425. Mm -hmm. Oh, heavy. Until I stretched. Did it with just the bar, felt really tight in my hip area, my glutes, all that stuff. Did one stretching exercise, did one stretching exercise, and that set right there with 135 felt a lot better. So I am gonna do a little bit more stretching, stretch my legs out, stretch my hips out, do some foam rolling, and then I'm gonna keep low bar squatting. I wasn't gonna low bar squat after that warm up set, but I'm gonna keep going. To my hands. These things right here just took all the pressure off my wrist. I promise you. I've never done it with wrist wrap. Just tried it this time for the first time with 275. It felt amazing. So wrist wraps, low bar squats. Get it man.
taking in consideration that I just had legs yesterday and I'm not even using my knee wrap, so I'm happy with that. Alright guys, so I kind of feel my body starting to like die down now, so um, I'm only going to do maybe like one or two more sets with the overhead press. Um, I kind of knew this was going to happen when I finally, when I finally got to overhead press, I was going to kind of be almost dead, but I'm going to still try to go hard, you know what I'm saying, because I still got to do biceps after this, so I'm still not done. But as far as the compound movements, this is going to be the last compound movement I do. I'm going to try to get two more sets though. I'm going to try to get two more sets because I don't want to, I don't want to downplay overhead press. You know, it is a very important exercise. That was 155. Um, that's it. That's it. I'm not doing it. I was going to try to go for um, 185. But um, I'm highly doubting myself right now because, and not because I don't think I can get it, but it's just because I've taxed my body so much doing all the other compound movements. I don't think that right now that I can get it right now. But the more I keep telling myself that I can't do it, the more I want to prove myself wrong. So you know what? I think I'm going to do it. Here we go, people. All right. So I'm about to go for 185. But I need y'all help. That's what I want y'all to do. Let's go, beast. Let's go, beast. Let's go, beast. Let's go. can't get it strict military press. So I'm gonna try to get a push press, which is what I just did. Uh, push press, you just get a little momentum from the knees, from bending your knees. So I'm gonna try to get it with push press. I'm gonna try to get a little bit more momentum though than I just did. I really did, I really wanted to get it military press. Not that strong yet. So I'm gonna try to get it with push press. If I can get it with push press, I'll be happy with that. And y'all ain't chatting loud enough. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Come on, man.
now's the charm. <laughs> Put on everything I have in my book bag to try to help me. Knee wraps and all. This ain't even got nothing to do with knees. <laughs> Woo. Nah, this this um this belt should help out a little bit though. Let's get it. Alright. If I don't get it this time, well, I'm gonna just try again, you know. I don't know, probably about two weeks. I'm gonna get this weight by the end of December. You heard it first, right here. Get it, man. Beast.